that dude. Dude, this this is the fish that we are here after. Big mountain rookie. Mm-hmm. Morning guys, Joel and I, we're out here today on the trout stream. It's been probably a month and a half, I'd say, since we fished together, month, month and a half. Um, it was actually the last dry fly video that we made. I'll put a link to the video right here if you guys wanna watch it, but Joel and I are out here today. We're gonna try and do some, some rookie fishing. We haven't done it in a while. And uh, one thing I wanted to mention was we had the pleasure of teaming up with Lively Legs and coming up with a our own Allegheny Native dry dropper box. So if you guys wanna check that out, you can uh, head over to Lively Legs and take a look at that. I'll put a link to that also down below in the video in the description. And um, it has everything from stimulators, caddis flies, uh, nymphs, double trouble nymphs, micro mops, just about anything that you would need to, to cover a good day of fishing. And we've been using them now for a couple months, catching wild browns on the river, uh, brook trout in the little streams. We were even using them towards the end of this past winter to, to catch some, some brook trout and some browns in the winter time. So really, really a nice little box to have. And uh, yeah, it'd be awesome if you guys would go check that out. But Joel and I, we're gonna work our way up the stream here and see how the day goes. All right, we'll see you guys on the water. Hey, why aren't we, uh, why aren't we getting any close-ups of the fish? Huh? Why aren't we getting any close-ups of the fish? They're fugly. <laughs> big, big fugly stocked fish. <laughs> They're fun, but ugly. Fugly. Oh yeah, good one. <laughs> Fugly? This one's better
Nice side one too. I think him jumping up like that, you see that? Yeah, that was awesome. That's exactly what we came here for. Huh? That's exactly what we oh came my here God. for. Yeah. Oh, fly's already out. For the Keystone guys, boy. See that dude? Dude, this this is the fish that we are here after. Definition of a mountain brookie. Holy cow. Big mountain brookie. Mm-hmm. Look at that fish. Two big ones, though. First one was bigger than that. Go ahead. We decided to stop and take a little little um, beer break and I wanted to tell you guys we've been getting a lot of messages about people wanting to order hats from us so we decided to order some hats so we have a bunch of hats uh, I created a website and I'll drop a link down below in the description if you guys want to you can head over head over to our website and order a hat we have a couple different colors we have this one it's the the charcoal gray and the white um, I think we have a black black and a charcoal a navy blue and gray, and then also uh, a camo. So, yeah, if you guys want a hat, head over there and and get one. It'll help us out. All right, we're gonna we're having a pretty good day. We're gonna keep on heading up the stream here.
Okay, so we're getting ready to leave, and we just came to a really deep hole. Joel took a couple casts in there with a dry fly, but no luck, so it's probably like, I'm gonna say five to six feet deep at least. He's gonna tie on a little jig streamer and jig it down through this through this run right here. There's a big rock that hangs out over, and we're gonna see if we can't get one more fish here before we have to end of the day. We're gonna give it a shot. I would go right for the rock, just right along, right along the edge right there. All right, guys, that's a wrap on today's video. No luck on the jig streamer there at the end. Um, like I said, if you guys want to pick, up, if you want to pick up a hat, I'll leave the link to the in the description down below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We really appreciate the feedback, and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. I was talking about my little portable battery pack. Is it blows up? <laughs>